Hey everyone, uh, Meg Norton here. I hope everyone had a wonderful uh, week last week and it's Wednesday, so that's exciting. Uh, this is my second video or my second vlog. So I have uh, taken the next action step and that is to post another one and there will be more to come. Um, I just wanted to kind of have uh, an open discussion about doTERRA um, and just a little bit about why I love them so much. Uh, the list goes on and on. Ah, excuse me. Um, so, you know, whether you're sharing, learning what doTERRA is um, or building the business, you have a why, right? So why you do what you do, why you share, why you build, um, why you use the oils. I think everyone has their why. Um, but then when you sit down with it and you really try to identify your why, um, I have found personally that you are, you know, racking your head against the wall. Um, you really have to let it flow in, you know, don't try to force anything. Um, it's just, hopefully it comes naturally, you know, to you. Um, for me, I kind of obsess over things and, you know, I, like I said last week, um, procrastinating, that is one thing that psh, I'm abolishing. So, um, you know, I fundamentally want to change the way people uh, look at their bodies how they feel, um, their wellness, their health. Uh, I, want, I want to create solutions and I want to use these essential oils, you know, while doing that. So that's what I'm doing. Um, I'm, I'm empowering others, empowering you to kind of take charge, you know. I mean, we talk about healthcare a lot. Uh, I am constantly hearing stories of, you know, these visits to the ER or rather no visits to the ER because of pre-existing conditions. Um, just really, you know, that's always this, unless you have insurance and you have, you know, that luxury and you pay for it, uh, you, you kind of get the, the boot. So that being said, let's talk about why I love doTERRA, okay. Um, doTERRA is, is really on the forefront of something. Uh, they, have, they have kind of and are paving the way for essential oils and really what essential oils are capable of. Um, and one way that they're doing that, which I personally have good feels for is their co-impact sourcing. You can actually get on doTERRA's website. I'm looking at it right now. And you can type in doTERRA co-impact sourcing and you can look at what they're doing. Um, Bulgaria, Kenya, Madagascar, Nepal, to name a few. They are really taking um, advantage of, you know, the culture and the history of where these oils are coming from, right? They're plants, so they have to grow, you know, in a place where they can get the best of everything. Sun, water, food, you know. Um, environment is everything. And in order to continue to provide these amazing oils at, you know, such a high, pure, form or level, you know, we have to source from really great places, but we also have to be mindful of how we're sourcing these products. You know, I, I believe that we're, <laughs> I, I like to say it's kind of a joke, but it's an instant gratification nation where, I mean, we can get anything and everything. We can go on a date, we can communicate, we can build our business, anything, we can do it all with a click. Instant. Instant gratification. Right? So doTERRA makes it possible for you to click away, purchase these oils, 
and all in the you know in the meantime they're working with these countries and really creating an opportunity for these countries to take charge of their own lives by um, helping us you know extract these oils right I mean that is kind of the the bottom line so that being said the reason one of the reasons I love doTERRA so much is because they really do have the awareness um, that I'm I'm in constant practice of which is to be mindful of not only you know how amazing and pure and beautiful these essential oils are but to be mindful of the long-term effects and long-term goals um, and helping heal the soil heal the water um, and and just continue to heal the planet in a sense all the while you know really absorbing some of these amazing benefits of the essential oils and products so I guess you know that was kind of just an open talk about it uh, I have so many reasons why I love doTERRA um, but the more I research this company and really invest myself in the company and the community of people I'm just mind blown I love it I, I can't wait to share more um, you know I definitely want to talk about ways to build the business and if you have any comments you can leave them below or you can find me on revitalize with Meg on my Facebook page um, and we can chat there too you know open community uh, so I just want to create you know the opportunity for you to become excited and want to take the next step into really healing you know your lives you're you know you deserve it and you're worth it and everyone is I mean we we're not here to slave away and to push people down to get to the top I mean we really have to understand that you know in becoming self-aware this is an experience you know we need to help lift others up and in doing that you know you can build a great team with me and um, you can learn from me and we can grow together so I look forward to talking with you guys soon and uh, yeah just you know take take the action step just get out there. The more times you take that step, the easier it becomes. So just remember that. Be mindful, be kind, and I will uh, talk with you guys very soon.